Just like students, school districts get graded on their achievements, growth, and qualifications. But often school district has had two schools seeing improvements the past couple of years. NBC 10's Gabrielle Pfeiffer spoke with one principal on how they were able to turn their school around. The Arkansas Department of Education released district-wide report cards for the past school year. The Norfolk Elementary School has made some gains since the last report, going from a D to a C. We um, noticed what students needed to have um, in order to support them and provide early interventions. And that way they can improve their academic growth and their achievement for our school year. They attribute that awareness to being more data driven. Teachers document how their students are performing so that they are meeting students' specific needs. So we wanted to make sure that the data was driving our instruction and that we were looking at the data every week and grade level meetings to support our students. All grade levels at the elementary school are focusing heavily on literacy. Oakland believes tackling reading first will impact other subject areas. We knew that it would um, really help in approving our students' achievement. This is Oakland's second year as principal. While she uh -huh. believes yes, focusing on it. data improves okay. scores, she also right. believes building relationships improves performance. Yes. If you Put in the time with them, get to know who they are, and then lead into what their academic needs are. Students will work for you. Oakland says her goal is to be the best school in the state of Arkansas. Reporting in Norfolk, Gabrielle Pfeiffer, NBC10, your local news leader. The middle school also saw improvements, bringing its grade up to a C from a D. Parents can see how their child's school ranks on our website. That's myarticlemiss.com.